Today in History 2nd October 1950, Sunny and Bright, United States Dear Diary, Today, something super exciting happened. A new comic strip called Peanuts gets published in lots of newspapers. I hear my older brother talking about it while he enjoys his breakfast. He tells me it's about a boy named Charlie Brown and his dog, Snoopy. I can't wait to read it myself and find out all about their amazing adventures. I learned that the person who draws Peanuts is named Charles Schultz. He is really good at creating funny and sweet stories about children and their feelings. I know that many kids like me sometimes feel lonely or worried. I think Charlie Brown is just like us, and it makes me happy to think I'll see my own worries in his story. There are lots of kids like Charlie in my school who feel shy or have a hard time making friends. Sometimes, I see my friend Lucy being a bit bossy and not very nice. But I also see how kind Charlie is to everyone around him. I think this comic strip is important because it can help us learn how to be better friends and share our feelings with one another. Peanut starts with a few characters, but I know more will join later. There's Shermie, who sometimes seems grumpy. And then there's Linus, who loves his blanket and thinks deeply about everything. I smile when I think about Snoopy being silly and imagining he is a brave flying ace. I wish I could have fun adventures like they do in the comic strip. Everyone at the diner where I go for lunch talks about the new strip. I hear adults laughing while chatting over their coffees, and that makes me want to read it even more. I even ask my mom if I can get a newspaper tomorrow to see the funny pictures and stories for myself. The day ends, and I can't stop thinking about Charlie, his dog, and all of their funny moments together. I believe Peanuts will be very popular since everyone loves to laugh and talk about it. I feel like this comic strip will make a big difference in how kids everywhere talk about their feelings. When I grow up, I will tell my own kids about the very first day it all began.